This screencast will show a full branch and merging sample. I was uh, very surprised to see how many people is very scared about branching, so I will try to demonstrate how easy it is. So we will start with a empty application and then uh, we'll make a couple of modifications in parallel. So we will simulate having two developers. So the first one will create a branch. Creating branches in plastic is uh, actually pretty simple. It's just uh, a couple of clicks away. So we are creating two branches, branch 001 and branch 002. And then uh, let's uh, make uh, different modifications on each of the branches. So let's go first to branch 001. So we just click on switch to branch. And then the workspace will get updated. At the moment, uh, there is no difference with, uh, with the main branch because no changes have been, has, have been done yet. So let's first uh, put a button. Okay, the first uh, functionality we will add will be just uh, a button that uh, once it's pressed will show a, a message dialog. So yeah, let's type it, message box, show, and put a sample text there. So when the user clicks the button, the message box will pop up. Well, the main aim of the sample is showing how uh, even UI, uh, a UI application can be modified in parallel. Okay, it's working. Can be modified in parallel and the modifications integrated back together to the main branch. So we go to the pending checkouts in Visual Studio, checking everything. So now we have finished the first modification. Let's go now to the second branch, branch 02. The switch to branch. Now the workspace will be updated and uh, the modified files on the first branch will be removed and we will start again with the blank application. This is because we are trying to simulate real parallel development so the two developers should be starting from the from, from a well-known point and then adding modifications from there. So now well, the second modification will be adding the typical file open menu with a open dialog being invoked when we click on, on the menu. So you, 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 you can realize that uh, that uh, both modifications are actually changing the same form, this, uh, this form one. So later on, they will have to be integrated together. Well, let's now put the code to invoke the, the open file dialog, this open file component we paste on the, on the form. And let's just now check the functionality. Okay, it's working. So, next step will be merging the two branches together to the main branch, which is normally the difficult step with a lot of version control systems. Well, I will first look at the history of form1.cs and we can see that there were two changes made in parallel that is exactly what we have been doing. So the switch to the main branch, now our workspace is pointing to the main branch and then let's make a first merge from branch 01. When we click on find merge, Plastic will actually look for all the files or directories that need to be merged. So we just proceed and well, first branch is merged automatically because there are no conflicts and then the second one will be the one with uh, a couple of uh, conflicts to, to solve because we have been actually changing uh, the two files well, the, the same files in, in, two, in two branches at the same time so first the, the file, yeah, the file form1.cs will show up and we see that we, okay, this is the file as it was at the beginning then we have both contributors and then on the bottom of the, of the dialog we see the, the result. So Plastic actually was able to, to merge the code, the code opening the dialog and the code showing the message box together. So it was actually automatic. And then the second one, this is the, the code modified by the designer to, 
to put the the buttons and the and the menu, the button and the menu. So it's a bit a little bit more complicated because there are much more changes, but Plastic actually managed to merge them all automatically. So we just have to confirm all of them. Yeah, they are all okay. So just save, finish, and the merge is finished. Let's check if everything was right or not. So we open again the solution. We look at the form and yes, here it is. We have both the menu and the button together and working. So merging is extremely powerful feature and plastic can handle it perfectly. And well, that's basically it. So merging and plastic working together.